fuck this, Peter. Let's just start a video. Hey, it's Peter. And it's Mike. From Roger Violence Gaming. And we're back with Hitman Blood Money playthrough. This is episode 9. And we are in the Death to Us part. Right, so we got the silver baller, and we actually don't think we need to do all the jabs in the sniper rifle. We'll do a quick upgrade just to make sure we have all the cool kick ass accessories, right? We'll improve all the flak pads, detonator, right? Blah, 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 blah. We need a foil pad and suitcase. We need the lock pick, and we need the extra mine, and, and the, the flak vest. vest. Flak vest, and then it has detonator, and everything else is already upgraded. That's lovely, wonderful. Yay! Large clip. Nah, I'm not gonna ruin the gun. Look, look how beautiful it looks at the moment. I'm not gonna ruin it. Some big ass clip. Well, okay, maybe I'll, maybe I'll enhance the snipe. Well, actually, no, fuck it. We can't enhance it anything else anymore. We'll start the mission. So, the first thing we're gonna need is an invitation. Now, Peter, where are you gonna find that? Remember? Uh, uh, in there, in that building. Oh, yeah, the, 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 we're gonna have the drunk guy here. Oh, there he is now. Oh, look at that. Oh, look, he's like a new Mad Eddie. He's like the American Mad Eddie. Local drunk, in case anybody doesn't know. Ah. <laughs> I love that the puke animation. It's like, yeah, puke on me, very. It's so weird because if you go on the dance floor, everyone just starts looking at you. It's like it's like someone from the the, will, the village. Village, village. Oh. Hey, look, his his his. Oh, I never know what's that. I never know that formal occasions. His suit jacket is closed. I thought that only happened in absolution. Really? I don't know about this on Hitman Vicky. Alright. See? But then you better watch out. It was uh, I actually mentioned how I was buttoned up. Oh. Oh this guy's taking fucking forever. I swear I'm gonna pop him if he doesn't hurry up. You could persuade him. I could persuade him by headbutt and every asshole here that actually has a gun. The first time I played this mission back in 2006 when I got my first PlayStation 2 and I got this was the first game I got free with it, which was brand new actually. It was uh, quite impressive. It was 40 euro at the time. 40 euro for a PS2 game. Can you imagine that today? Jesus. Right, I'm so not gonna wait for him. And when I paid for him, I, I, you know, I just went around and I found the man. I just shot him straight there in the crowd. I was like, what are they gonna do? Just a bunch of hillbillies. Turns out every single one of them is this fucking six shooter on them with six bullets. Now, if you have a fucking, how can, how can they not spot him? That he's not a fucking hillbilly, but an albino fucking cone with a barcode on the back of his head and a custom made fucking Italian suit that he's wearing in a place like this. Look at it. It screams hillbilly everywhere. The house doesn't. And talks to the bride. Uh, puts the, talks to the bride and puts the bride in a basket. What the fucking? Get the, out. The basket. Ah. Oh, not the fucking pills. Get out. Why you make like a tweeting attack to fear? Just fucking. There we go. <laughs> That was really, really inconspicuous. Nobody needs to know. Oh shit! Never mind. Wrong door. Oh, oh fucking hell! It's mother of sodomy, right? Um, oh the priest, right? Let's follow. Let's follow him. All right, never mind. We're gonna follow him. The washroom. Oh, father. Father, I have sinned. I have confessed to come I've, I have kidnapped little. Oh no! The groom is dead. <laughs> Alright, oh great, so the, the guy's actually not here, he's actually in the fucking... And I never packed my sniper rifle. Ugh. Well, I could use your expertise aiming. Expertise aiming that I don't have. That I have. Uh, JK. I'm like, who's that guy? Oswald? Harry Lee Oswald, was it? Lee Harvey Oswald. That guy. Man. Thing. Anyway, I'm not unlike him. I can't just shoot this guy through the back of the skull. Um, uh, right. Pew, pew, pew. All right. So I'm gonna change the quickly outfit. Right now we look like some some asshole. Right? Anyway, you look like someone from the from Discovery Channel program. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, actually. On this like... episode of Pawn Stars, <laughs> I look like a really bad version of um, what's his name, uh, Mickey Rourke, from Once Upon a Time in Mexico. Yeah, Mexico. And I agree, he's actually walking around with a bag of, oh my god, the godfather himself. Kill him! Alligator? Alligator? Alligators, man. 
that's what they use these shotguns for. Uh, worst thing, worst thing is, right? I dressed up as one of these guys. I got a shotgun like these guys. I, right, I'm gonna try to push this guy in there if I can into this grave. But anyway, push him into a grave. There's a grave here. I stand by. He starts mourning by it. I, I just, I probably to push him into the water if I could. But, well, mm, well, that worked, I guess. And one of the alligators is gonna come take him now. We just have to wait and see. Run! They'll discover the body. I'm not gonna discover that body anyway. Never mind. They just did. Anyway, so I dressed up as the guy. I got the shotgun like a guy. I start shooting the alligators like those guys, and they all start popping me in the head with the shotgun. Who you know was what? The, who was the client? The client. I think. Oh, it was herself. The wife. The wife was herself. The client. Hold on. I'll tell you now. Actually, info. Uh, uh my intel. Uh, let's buy my intel. Guns and. Shooting in outdoor areas only make rednecks panic. It actually says rednecks. It actually says That's rednecks. And it's capitalized. Uh, what are the home alligators? The priest rings the wedding bell. The father is and the brother very buried. Okay, so the brother was the gay guy. The gay... The gay... The gay captain. Captain Muldoon was the, the brother of the... Of the... The... the, the the the, the, the the fucking godfather I just killed here. God, I'm so confused. I'm trying to m fucking manage to navigate through this show. Anyway, the, the, the fucking Yuan is the client. The bride is the client. Ah, and where are you going now? I'm going back to my boat. Our boat. His boat. Just fuck it. Let's dance, yo, come on, everybody. Let's dance. Come on, everybody, dance. Dance. I'm just dancing. Ah, oh, fuck this, Mickey Rourke. Has, these guys are not on a Mickey Rourke here. That was a piece of shit compared to the Mickey Rourke. <laughs> and we're back. Actually, I can never actually imagine 47 traveling with this. Like, he uses like a little rubber duck kind of style blow up boat. Well, anyway. Oh, well. He uses what he needs to. Oh, Hitman. Hitman. <laughs> so we got the Hitman rating. Hitman wanted by police. police. And weirdly, there's no witnesses, just this picture of this greedy asshole. Alright, that's the end of episode 9. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And like our official Virtual Violence Gaming fan page, link in the description below. And also, remember to follow us on Facebook at Virtual Violence. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.